What is preventing non-Muslims from Islam is either that Allah knows they're so bad, Allah is not going to guide them. They don't deserve guidance or we Muslims don't have the bravery that the Sahaba did in conveying the truth. So we lie and we cheat and we claim things that are not part of Islam. And guess what? Not all of them are dumb. They can tell when we lie. They can tell when someone sits behind it and says, Islam is peace. Islam is about peace. There's no jihad. The only jihad is the jihad of the soul. You fight against your struggle, you know, your shaitan, khalas. That's where jihad ends. Every ayah you read in the book of Allah, you have misunderstood it. Ya Sheikh, haram alayk ya Sheikh. Why are you afraid to tell the people the truth? Don't you think Allah gave him a brain? Don't you think this kafir is going to open the Quran, read Surah Al-Anfal, and he's going to come across these ayat, the military ayat, which you've been trying to hide? Then what are you going to do? Then he's going to say, you guys were lying to me the whole time, and you keep telling me something, and here's your book, here's your Quran. Oh no, but no. See, you don't understand. This ayah it was actually abrogated by the other ayah, لَكُمْ دِينُكُمْ وَلِيَدِينَ so now they twist things around. If that was in the beginning. I mean, ajib, ya akhi. So you keep playing and with the deen of Allah and changing and altering and sugarcoating to please a bunch of people. And at the end of the day, the da'wah is lost in the process.